marketing company with a product, you know, and I built a team. I made the car bonus, uh, $750 a month for a car. Team's going crazy, building like crazy, and all of a sudden it's just whoosh, landslide. Everything went away. So I, I lost, I never did get the car bonus. My team's dwindling, my commissions are dwindling. So now at this point, I ran out of family and friends to talk to. You know, not sign anybody else up. They're not, they're, they're not signing anybody else up. So now I need, uh, I'm looking for something to help me continue to build that, that business. And somebody else a year later contacted me and told my, told Mike, I want you, uh, I want you to take a look at this. It's on passive. And I didn't connect the two at that time. So she sent me some videos and she's told me a little bit more about this company that would do marketing for you for whatever you're doing and guarantee you signups. So she sent me as, as all of you know, most of us are founders here. You look in your back office and there's all these videos, right? There was, at that time, there was about 29 videos. So she sent me, she sent me all 29 videos. And in the email, she says, just pick one. So I picked one and I watched the video. <laughs> Curious me, I watched all of them. Now they're all pretty much the same, but it kept, I kept hearing the same thing. They're going to do the marketing for you. I thought, okay. So I decided to go ahead and sign up for it because I was looking again now for something to someone to do some marketing for me. And when I got signed up, there was nobody to talk to. The person that I signed up with, I asked her, so, you know, tell me a little bit more. She didn't know, you know, so she really didn't have any information. Well, so we go to the person that was above her who couldn't get any answers there. So I'm just really struggling trying to figure out I wanted, I wanted to know everything. When I'm going to do something, I want to know everything I can about it so I can talk intelligently to someone else. So because I'm having these darn, I started having these webinars because Tom tells me to. <laughs> when Tom tells you to do something, you do it. <laughs> and so I got on a webinar and I got a bunch of people jumping on and I don't know what to say to them. I'm, I'm stumped for words. So I, as I'm searching around on Facebook, and YouTube and different areas looking to, you know, Google, trying to get some answers about this for myself, I find Marty DeGarmo on Facebook. But more importantly, I find Mike Ellis here on YouTube. And now I'm getting some answers. I'm getting more, um, getting more information. So now I can share with others, but still I'm not the type of person like Mike Ellis is to present eloquently and in a format that that really delivers. So I reached out to Mike Ellis and asked him to come on our call and it was history. We just, you know, he came in, he's been helping us out with the, the Wednesday night calls, helping us deliver the message, helping us build a team. And I'm just so grateful for that. One of the other things that I want to say is, you know, I was on the call Thursday, but yeah, back in the beginning, so I get on these calls with Ashton Navarre and he's like, It'd be like for hours. And like Mike Ellis says in the beginning, you just don't want to listen to it. But there was something about this man that captures you and drew me in. And I just kept listening. And the more I listened, the more I was infected by Ashman Farr and on passive. So I'm on Thursday call. And it was cool. You know, he's sitting in his car and he's like, he's there for quite a while. And, and he did something that made a lot of sense to me. It's like, why are we having this kind of success? And on passive with on passive nation and with the people that we bring into on passive and, and all of you why are we having this success and oh 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 <laughs> oh so he took this chart and he held it up and well we know these things right these circles and what he did was he went like this oh and i thought here in on passive I have seen evidence here more so than any of the other companies. I've been involved in network marketing for over 30 years. And the people above you are always above you. They're never building you up. If anything, they let you down. When we turn that chart over, we build people up here. Mike and uh, Marty and Dan have helped me with all, with all of my team. They, they helped me build Viviana up. I've seen it when I was on the webinar with uh, David in Papua New Guinea and all of these people that were coming out that he built up 
And on passive, we build each other up. So I'm gonna leave it at that. That's, that's my little bit of a journey here. Love the family, love the community, love all these people. And uh, so Marty, I'll let you take it over from here. If you're there. I'm here, but somebody else take it for right now. I'm, I'm adding more people. I'll be, I'll be with you in Okay, a minute. yeah. I know how that is. So yeah, we're up to 140. There we go. Mike Ellis, come on out and uh, kind of let's, let's get this fireside chat started. Yeah, I haven't haven't seen you all all for a little bit, so it's it's nice to be here. You know, you talked yeah. about how you found Marty, Mike. Well, mm -hmm. I found Arthur Gully. That's yeah. how that's that's how awesome Unpassive is. There's always someone out there that can give you a little something you've never had before, and uh, w we find that every single day. Uh, really, really talented people in Unpassive working together. Uh, with, with the same goal and and yeah the goal is to help people but we also want to make a little bit of money and if you know anything about on passive you're pretty much in the right place um, Marty and I we've never seen anything like this we've been doing this probably as long as Mike has and and the downfall with online businesses is you really can't help anybody I mean it's it's just not set up to help anybody and most people aren't going to be foolish enough, like I was, to spend 15 years getting the skill sets that I have. I, I don't know how I did that. Uh, I think it was divine intervention because uh, it, it was a long haul. But, but meeting Marty, meeting Dan, meeting the people that are here today, um, it, it's been a treat. It's been a treat to, uh, to, to go down this, uh, this road together and actually find something. You know, it's funny, it doesn't matter who you are. If, if you're here, obviously you're probably a founder, but maybe you're not. Maybe you've never, maybe you've never done any online businesses before. Uh, it doesn't matter. If this is your first day on, uh, on the internet, you got lucky because you are in a place that will change your life forever financially. The spiritual side, I'm gonna let you deal with that. Financial side, we can deal with that today and I can guarantee you're going to make money and you're going to make more money than you've ever made in your lifetime. That's how, that's how big on passive is. I know most of the people that are here, you haven't seen the pay structure. <clears throat> you haven't seen the five tiers of the pay structure. Maybe you've seen one and even that's bigger than what you think. And as, as we're able to share this stuff with you, and I, I can't right now because Ash won't let us, but as we're able to share all five tiers of the pay structure, you think you're gonna make a little bit of money? No, you don't have a clue what's coming. It is so massive. And this is Ash Mufara, uh, uh, really it's the bottom line, it's his heart. He is sharing so much of the proceeds of Unpassive with all of us, every single one of us here. <clears throat> that as, as on passive launches, soft launch, hard launch, and it's coming. Don't worry about that, guys. It's coming. But soft launch, hard launch, and then we can start to talk about the five tiers of the, uh, of the, uh, of the marketing, uh, not the marketing, but the pay structure. Uh, you think you were blown away? Uh, I can guarantee everybody here is going to be smiling ear to ear. And you might not get into the second or the third or the fourth or the fifth tier right away. But on passive is built. This is what's really, really cool. It's built to get you to that second tier, third tier, fourth tier. You get to the fourth tier. I, I, I mean, you're, you're living wherever you want to. Really, you're living wherever you want to live as on passive launches. And any of those those uh, those pesky little things that that you wake up and you go, man, I I just wish I could take care of that. It's taken care of, guys. That's how awesome on passive is. So, you know, I, I, I could go on and on and on. I wish I could, I could share all five tiers of the pay structure. Uh, you'd absolutely love it. And, and that's coming. That's coming very, very quickly. Probably within the next month or so, uh, we'll be able to come on and, and go over all five tiers. Uh, I can tell you, Marty, Dan, and I, uh, Mike, Viviana, the leaders that are here today, very exciting time not only for us, but for, for everybody that's here. Um, you're, you're just in a really, really good place. Marty, what do you got to say? 
or can you talk yet? Yeah. I know your house is a, <laughs> it's always crazy. It's yeah. still crazy, but I can talk. Yeah, no, you're right, Mike. Uh, every every month that goes by, I realize this is ten times bigger than I thought it was. And every time I go to a webinar or talk to Ash, I realize you know you start linking <clears throat> stuff together, and you realize there's so many things linked together that it's just gonna it's gonna put a whole web around the whole planet and. If you need something online, you're going to go through on passing, whether you like it or not. And it'd be so much better if you're if you're a founder. <laughs> it's just that simple. I mean, if you could be a founder for '97, I just can't see why. Ever, I mean, I know there's 400 and some thousand people. I'm surprised there's not a million. And <clears throat> there's going to be millions and millions that wish they did. I can tell you that. In a short amount of time, when it launches, there's gonna be a lot of people coming back on. Oh my gosh, I should have. Yeah, I should have. I know they're not coming to me saying you didn't tell me. Because anybody that breathes and can walk on their uprights, I tell them, including the postman, uh, the guy delivering stuff to the house. So, you know, but like I always say, even if people tell you no, it's just no for now, they'll be back. And some people are just negative yeah. and I don't want to work with them anyway. So, but yeah, we got something really, really big here. Really, really big. If anybody wants to come onto the panel, raise your hand. I'm adding people as I see names that I know, but it'd be easier if you raise your hand, I can add you. But anybody here can uh, open up the mic and say something because this is a uh, fire. Marty, I just want to say that. that. Okay, go ahead. I'll just say first, if you're here, and you're new, or if you're, you've are you been with Don Passive for a while and you're just coming back and, and chiming back in, uh, I said a little bit about Marty, uh, Mike Ellis, and, and their partner, Dan Street. Dan is in the mountains today. He's um, kind of out and about, so he's not here with us. But Dan Street, Mike Ellis, and Marty DeGarmo are on Passive Nation. They are a, a team with inside of On Passive Nation. They're not on Passive. Built a huge team. And that's who we're, you know, we have here tonight representing us and, and being really kind of the spokespeople. So I just want you to know that Marty DeGarmo does a Facebook Live every morning at nine o'clock my time, Pacific time. Just a great place where we kind of hang, get together and we, we always get to hear what's kind of what's update and just to get, get our, you know, get filled up with on passive. Mike Ellis does YouTube's uh, great job of keeping us up to date on what's going on has been doing it for a long time they're, they're great youtube videos and dan does blogs that you can find in on passives um facebook group so, so these, these guys are just really have been you know, like i say we build each other up how, how are we build they keep us informed and tuned up and, and excited all the time it's like we there's no we're never not excited every day we wake up and we're thinking okay what is going to be today what are we going to get to hear today these calls are, they keep us excited. That Marty's Facebook Live every morning. I try to get on there if I'm on, I'm on the road. He's, he's heard me, it's like, I've, I've got my cell phone on. I'll pull over, I'll put my cell phone on, stick it in the cup holder and drive down the road and, and listen to the Facebook Live. Just because just I want to keep that uplift. And it's like, you know, like with all you guys here, Peter Rogers, John Cyrus, uh, Liam Bonet and Arthur Goley. You know, Arthur Goley, I'm not sure if you're there, um, Arthur Goley, I'm not sure what it is that they love about you so much, but maybe you can come out and talk to us a little bit and we might be able to figure that out. <laughs> hey. Well, let me get my camera on you. Yeah, we want to see that pretty face. <laughs> On Passive, we boldly go where no other company has gone before. Welcome, everyone. You know, I'm a more charismatic type person, so I get hyped up a lot. But I'm going to uh, take my time here for a second. Mike, thank you for uh, having me here. I've been on a couple of your, your Zooms here. But I have been busy. Uh, as a mentor, and if, if anybody didn't know that, I closed it down, but I still I'm still available. Cause I'm in on passive. We over deliver. 
So if anyone have any questions that I can answer for them, and if you live in the United States and have a telephone number uh, in the United States, then we'll get on the phone and we'll talk. Just like we talk here, you just got to be prepared to listen because I, I will stay on the phone with you, just like Ash, I'll, I'll, two, three, four hours, it doesn't matter to me. I sleep and live on passive. And the reason I do that is because, I, just like everybody else, I've been involved in a lot of uh, businesses since I was 12 years old. I became an entrepreneur at that age and I uh, went into the military and it's just stuck with me. And when I discovered on passive, man, it just blew me away. I never seen anything like this in the world. Never. The people, the family we have here, uh, you guys are more closer to me as a family than my own family. I mean, I, I see you regularly. Uh, we communicate regularly. We show love and compassion towards each other. And what I've learned something of the last couple of months, there's a lot of brilliant minded people here. I mean, look at the videos that's coming out all over the place. When Ash came out, he started something, oh, hey, let's do some promotion on some of these videos and we'll send some uh, traffic to him. He said, I'm gonna send so many video, uh, so much traffic to this, to one video. When I looked at, watched about two or three of them from the top and they were growing regularly, you know, it, it went to a hundred and something, I think. And I looked at those videos, I was like, wait a minute, uh, I just don't have a hard time with this one. He gonna need to give more traffic to more than one video. And when he did to get a chance to see it, he, he, he came on and told us that same thing. Uh, it's gonna take some time because I'm gonna have to send traffic to more than one video. And and I tell you, it, it for some reason, that, that was hidden talents here. And that brought a lot of talents out. I would do more videos myself, but uh, I'm so busy now doing other things. Uh, uh, eventually, I probably would. But uh, And then now I've been interviewed in a few uh, 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 Tyra. She interviewed me. And then uh, there's a Monday I'm going to be on the Julian Milo show. <laughs> and so I'm getting some exposure. Uh, but yes, people, you're in the right place at the right time. You, you, you're passive, or uh, 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 even if you're not passive, whatever it is, enjoy this ride because this is going to be something going to happen. It's going to happen so fast that we're gonna, not going to be able to keep up with it. But just remember this. Don't worry, if you're new, don't worry about what you can and can't do at this moment. Do what you can do, and all you can do is, is enough. But here's the thing. When you become passive, you're paying the company to do all the work for you. You can do whatever you want to do after that. You don't have to worry about anything. But I don't use the word team. It's a network to me because you have, we have to watch our language now because people are thinking when you say teams and fill over, first thing come to people's mind oh, is network market. Oh, it's one of those. Well, we're not one of those. We are a IT, information technology company. We're brick and mortar. We're compliance and all over the world. So we're different. We are. That's why that's that thing above my head said we bold to go where no other company has gone before, and there hasn't been. And I want to thank you all for your time, and uh, just want to remind you if you need any help, uh, reach out to me. I'm available 24/7. I take naps in between. I'm up all night. So when you are going to bed, I'm probably still up. When you are up, I'm probably taking a nap, and then I'm back up with you. Thank you for your time, and thank you all, uh, Mike, Marty, Dan, uh, Mike Horn, uh, everyone here. I appreciate you all. Sean Sire, oh, man, he's my buddy. <laughs> he's just like a brother to me. But I like to hear all of you speak, and, and, and it's all about passion. And I want to say one last thing. Have you noticed that everybody that speaks on this platform, on any of our Zooms, they are they're speaking from their heart. They're not taking a script. If you go on this other stuff, you can tell who's a, who's an actor, even as they say it at the bottom of the screen. Uh, these are not actors. Oh, they are acting. 
they act just, they, 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 you know, they don't come in and, and speak from their heart, uh, you know, yeah. and be unscripted. So I want to thank you for your time. Well, thank you. Thank you so much, Arthur Goley. And we do love you. <laughs> so thank I'm going to turn it back over to Marty because this is, you know, again, Marty and, and Mike, they're, 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 and, and Dan are really responsible for this, this huge activity. And you, you know, so many more people. I mean, I got some people on a call here, but uh, you guys are just uh, king. So back to you, Marty. Thanks. <clears throat> By the way, Mike, you said you're really happy when you met me, but you were super happy when you met Mike. So I know where <laughs> I stand. Anyway, uh, we have. You just had somebody that could talk for me. I, know, I always knew that you could talk, but I just. See, there you go I, I again. Some, yeah, I I, yeah, so you're saying I got a big mouth. I got it. I got it. <laughs> hey, Peter Rogers. We, we love it. He's the one that started this, this whole shebang. I yeah, hunted, I hunted him down, didn't I, Peter? Tell the story, mm -hmm. Peter. <laughs> I can't really speak too much because my little boy's next door asleep, and it's it's uh, twenty past uh, midnight here. So, um, right. Uh, but um, obviously, Marty contacted me. I mean, I've, I know Marty for probably two or three years previous, and uh, we worked together on another platform, and. Um, Sort of disappeared from that platform where Marty was still involved and then he left and he wanted to know what I was doing and uh, contacted me and uh, I said Marty I said you need to look at this you need to look at on passive so I gave him the information and, uh, and obviously this is where we are today him and Marty obviously Mike and Dan you know they, they've built a tremendous team uh, obviously put all this together and uh, you know, I'm obviously pleased they're part of my team as well. And um, but I'll leave it at that. I don't want to say too much because I'll get, I don't want to wake my little one up. Okay. So I'll, I'll just listen if you don't mind. Yeah, you don't want to get in trouble, Peter. <laughs> yeah, that's basically yeah. it. <laughs> that's usually that's what's wrong with me. I'm in trouble every day. Somebody's got something to say. Viviana, that big smile on your face. Oh, he's mm. laughing. Hey, Marty. Yeah. Hey, Peter, thank you very much for sharing this with Marty. Yeah. As if you didn't <laughs> share it with Marty, none of us would be here. You and Red opened the door for this. Thank you very much. Well, and, he, he uh, opened it a little bit. And we slammed it down, didn't we, Peter? <laughs> yes, you did. Yes, you yeah, did, I mean, Mr. DeGarmo. Hey, and obviously... Uh, uh, I just want to you, say uh, was, you keep talking about gurus and what I have learned from you, Peter read the gurus. Yeah. They bring you in and they're good at it and they will help you make a sale so that they can take more of your money because you have to pay a Weber, you gotta pay this, you gotta pay who, God knows how many there are that go on through that. Marty, you know that as well as anybody. Um, and I, I think that's very true. Uh, Ash Mufara is not that kind of person. He has built something that is so special that I'm afraid that, uh, you know, I'm disappointed that I won't live long enough to see the total effect of what this is going to do across the globe. This is going to be huger than huge. This is going to rock the entire globe to a new way of doing things. It will do it to governments, schooling, all across everything we think of. It is massive. I am so excited and so privileged to be part of this team. I thank We're you, Marty. I thank you, Mike, Ellis. Yeah. 
I thank you, Mike Court, and especially my Viviana. She introduced me to this. <laughs> my Viviana, I like that. Well, she's my sister. I thank all thank of you, you for being part. Yeah. Let's go on this journey together and enjoy the ride. Because when this clutch pops, the dragster is going to go down the road for that quarter mile and set records. Yep. Thank you again, Tim. Really appreciate you. Thanks, Tim. And I appreciate what you've said there. Uh, and I mean, all I really want to say here is that everybody's got a story to tell here. You know, when, when, when I saw this opportunity, I mean, I'm not no guru. I'm, I'm not really uh, into sort of working on the internet. It's only over the last couple of years that I've got involved with working on the internet and learning about how to do an online business. And it's taken me, you know, up until now. And um, but as I said, everybody's got a story. And when I, when I saw this opportunity with Red Redfern, I mean, I was just blown away by Ash and how he put it across. I mean, we all know Ash. <laughs> We've listened to his webinars. And he can go down one road and then go off down another. And so it really takes a lot to take in what Ash is saying. And he's a lot better today to what he was back, you know, two and a half, three years ago when we first met Ash. Ash was all over the place. And um, it took... Now, when I had uh, when I went on his first webinar, I sort of just listened to that webinar, and I was sort of I was taken back what he not but what he was saying, but about his his passion, the way he was putting it forward, and about his honesty. That's that's what got me involved in this. And um, you know, I said to Ash, uh, to uh, sorry, to Red afterwards after the webinar, I said, you know, I, I don't really understand what Ash is trying to really put across here. He's got a fantastic concept, you know, but it's, it's, it was just bits and bobs of everything just thrown in in this webinar, which you just couldn't sort of, you could sort of take and make sense of some of it, but not all of it. But as I said, you know, the passion and how he was putting it across, that, that's what got me involved. Is, is true, is, it was from the heart. And, um, you know, and obviously Red, Red was sort of, he was interested and uh, but he, and he came on board, you know, more or less a bit, a bit after me because I used to listen to the webinars a little, a little bit before Red did, you know, although Red introduced me to the business, you know, we were involved in another platform. So Red was sort of focusing more on that at the time and keeping his hand in that one. And I was sort of in the background, obviously trying to work this one out. And, uh, and then obviously I said to Red, I said, oh, you know, we really need to look at on passive and really make something work with this. And, um, you know, and, you know, I think we were involved probably 12 months before uh, Marty contacted me and wanted to know what I was up to. So, you know, I'd already been involved quite a while and already built a sort of a, a good, strong team as well, as well as obviously what's happened now. And, um, but I, I can honestly say this, you know, with these guys, you know, you've got Mike, uh, Dan and Marty, the team has just exploded, and it then you know obviously it's benefited me, but it's benefiting everybody here, and um, it, it you know you can you can tell what um, especially when Mike when he does his videos, you know you listen to that video and you know nine times out of ten I listen to it and it's on a, like a relap, and I listen to it again and again and again. You know, I'm, I'm not the brightest spark in the book. <laughs> you know, I have to listen to things quite a lot of times to get it to sink in up here. And, uh, you know, and like they've just said, like, they obviously know things that we don't know yet. <laughs> you know, and um, obviously they're talking to Ash, and Ash has obviously given them a little bit of insight. But I think we've got a big, big surprise coming our way, and it's going to really, it's going to wake us all up. And uh, like, you know, we had the webinar, the, uh, found, the, the Founders webinar on Thursday. I mean, Ash was obviously a bit unhappy about the amount of people that really was on that webinar. There should have been, a, you know, for the, considering the amount of people, founders that we've got in this organisation, there should have been a lot more. So I can understand in a way that he was obviously a bit, you know, because he's putting, he's putting his heart and soul into this for us. That's what it boils down to. And... Um, 
and I, you know, I recommend everybody to get on the webinars. I'm, I try to listen to every webinar I can get my ears around, you know, and, uh, you know, you do pick up bits and bobs. You know, I'm not a public speaker. I'm not, I'm not a one for making videos. I'm not like, like Red or, you know, Mike who can, you know, do these re really well videos and things like that. I'm a guy, I call myself a silent leader. I'm a guy that's in the background. I'm doing a lot of work on the Facebook groups. You know, I am building big teams, helping other leaders. And uh, so, you know, you, you don't see much of me, but I am definitely around and I'm definitely in it to win it like the rest of you. So anyway, I'll pass it over back to, to, to Marty. Okay. So anybody got anything else? I'm sure you do. Viviana, I was in the process of bothering you and I stopped. <laughs> How are you doing? Um, <laughs> well, I what attracted me to on passive is like I always say in all the all the zooms, it's a simplicity. I mean, I I've been in other companies. I I've have always wanted to have my own business since I was in in my twenties. So you know, so it's like a, everything I've tried whether it was multi-level marketing or anything, I just could not, I couldn't get it to work. I couldn't get it to get off the ground, you know? So, and I, in my problem is like a lot of people out there, the, the marketing part, you know, knowing how to market your, the business. And I became friends, you know, I became the NF part of the NFL group, which is no friends left. Right. <laughs> so, <laughs> so I, I, you know, I, it happens. So um, when I when when Mike Hoare told told me about the company and you know I didn't have to recruit and they would build the business for me, I'm like, oh get out, <laughs> that can't be possible. And you know as as I started learning about it, it just kept I kept wanting to to know more and more and more. But I remember going through the old you know the old training videos and and watching the Matrix and. And uh, I came across one, you know, that Ash did at the beginning and he started throwing all these numbers and I'm like, these ridiculous amounts of numbers, you know, that, you know, if you work the business, this is, you know, what you can make. And to me, they were so huge. It's like, really, I can actually, I can actually make that much per month, you know, or or whatever that figure was and so um but but anyways it wasn't so much about the, it was about the money yes when i came in that's what attracted me the simplicity and the, and the money but as i started get as i started you know doing the webinars with with, with mike and you know marty dan and uh mike is um it became more than just a business it, we all come together, we all share, we're all a big family, and we all have the same needs. We all want to take care of ourselves, our families, and also help others become successful. And, and if they're not in on passive, we'll have the, the, we'll have the means to help them, you know? So whatever your passion is or whatever you want to be a part of whatever organization whatever um charity you want to help you'll have the money to do that you know so so that's what's so great about this it's like we're not competing with each other you know we're here we're not all from the same team and we don't have to be but we're all here to help each other succeed you know and um so that that's what's so so wonderful about it and and i think the part that excites me more than anything is whoever i talk, tell about this this company and whoever i i can bring in and, and help them financially and help them succeed that's what that's what is exciting and i can only imagine if i feel that way how does ash feel he's created something that we can all succeed in and w what a beautiful thing i mean i it's it's like it's unreal i mean it's real but it's like uh you know it's, it's definitely a dream 
So yeah, this is this is such a great opportunity, and uh, we're all gonna <laughs> we're we're all gonna pass out <laughs> when we launch because we're like gonna go. What is that? <laughs> we're we're gonna look at our back office, and we're like gonna go. Is that really mine? <laughs> is that is that amount of money really mine? But like I said, it's. Ash is, is such a giving person. He's so he's not a selfish person and he's sharing the wealth with us. And he's teaching us to share that wealth with others. So yeah, this there's nothing like it. There's nothing like it on the planet. And we're we're definitely a part of on passive planet. We're we're out of this world. So so yeah, in, invite other people to, to come on this planet with us. <laughs> Fantastic. Hey, Marty. Uh, Rod, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Uh, well, one thing I can say is I am glad that I, that I wound up taking the second look. And then after I took the second look, you know, I got that, I got that, got that feeling of, of, uh, of, you know, be it on my own. And then that's whenever, you know, I wound up and, uh, you know, reaching out to, to, uh, to on passive nation. And, you know, I would say that right there's probably the, this, uh, probably the safest, uh, you know, the safest move I made. And, uh, you know, because you know, I started listening, you know, because, you, know, you know, I had been listening every week, every time that Ash had a webinar, even even before there was a website or anything, you know, I mean, you know, I was just listening all the time and, and, uh, and I was going, man, I, you know, I wish that I could have, you know, I wish I'd get on, you know, I wish I'd get on, you know, get on non passive nation because man, I, you know, if it, I'm not a builder, you know, I'm just like everybody else, you know, I, you know, with the NFL club and all that stuff, you know, I said, I am not a builder at all. And then, and then, and then you wound up offering, you know, those positions and I jumped on it. I mean, you saw how, how quickly I jumped on it. And, uh, and so whenever that happened, you know, it finally sunk in, you know, that you know, it really doesn't matter. <laughs> and, uh, and, you know, it, the more, you know, that I ended up uh, listening to everybody, you know, the, I guess probably the the more comfortable I got, and uh, yeah, because the major, you know, the major difference that I've seen, because I've been in a ton of different companies, and the you know this one company that I was that I was with, they made the statement, you know, hey, if you you know, if you get 40 people, I'll come, you know, I'll come talk to them. And my thought process is that I don't need 40 people to talk to. If one person needs me, I'm there. And if that's just my mindset, I mean, that, you know, I mean, you know, you know, just one just the one is, is good. And, uh, you know, and, you know, because, you know, you know, my heart, you know, I know the, the last time I spoke, you know, you know, I'm wanting to, you know, go out and help orphans and orf and orphanages and, you know, the homeless mm -hmm. and, things, you know, things along that. And heck, 
you know, you know, you know, that's the one, <laughs> you know. But, you know, uh, it's nice, you know, you know, to have, you know, to have surrounded myself, you know, you know, you know, with, uh, with everybody here. And it's also nice to know that's how, you know, that, you know, that's Ash's heart too. But anyway, I just wanted, just wanted to kind of, you know, express my heart. Very good, Rod. Hey, Rod, I just want to, I want to add something here. It's like, I think one of the things that I keep hearing from so many people is it's so easy to sell something that you don't have to sell. Will you agree with me, Rod? So <laughs> we don't have to sell this. It sells itself. Um, Marty, there was somebody on the uh, chat here. Yeah, I, 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 I agree like, with you. I couldn't find my mute button. <laughs> okay. I agree. <laughs> <laughs> I agree. <laughs> so easy to sell something you don't have to sell. Why, why, is, why do we have so many people come into this? You don't have to sell it. You just share it, right? We yeah, never have I mean, anything like that. Yeah, it's, I mean, it's all done for you. <laughs> How easy can that be? Yeah. Marty, somebody was wanting to, to, um, to say something that was on the chat. I keep trying to follow the chat. Man, I'm telling you what, I go through the chat, and I am just blown away by how many people we have from all over the world here tonight. Yeah, I just love that. Um, I'm going to read this. Hi, I am Anthony Vanaparte from Trinidad and Tobago. I, I thank Almighty God for my heart for Mike and Marty uh, the, for the wonderful job you all are doing. It's a blessing to be a founder on On Passive. Love that. Uh, thanks so much. And then I just wanted to see, uh, this was from, I not heard this, uh, Professor Howard. I would like to speak with Marty. Well, you'll have to get with Marty. Canada, I'll just go back, but uh, um, yeah, if you want to maybe send a, a private message out to Marty, you can, but um, Marty, I'll let you, you know, go, go back to you. I just, I, I just, this is really cool. You know, we'll come together on this hangout fireside chat. I wish I had a fire going behind me. Some, somebody had that going uh, last week. That was, that was cool. Uh, so back to you, Marty. This is open mic night. Let her rip. Everybody's, yeah, come on Everybody's out. got something to say. Come on. Sean, don't hey, try to hug. Hey, can I say something? David? Yes, sir. Yes, you can. Hey, you're, I'm, I'm finally going to get to talk. I mean, you guys never let me talk, so now I get to, get to talk. David <laughs> on Passive Switzer. <laughs> now, I, I've been, you know, I want to say it to the new founders, I've been in marketing before a little bit, you know, and my problem is I jumped in it too fast and I should have checked it out a little bit more, but I did lose a lot of money in marketing and, and so I kind of gave up on it a little bit and then happily, I, I was going through my um, laptop one day and, and I heard somebody's talking about, uh, well, I seen him on my laptop and he was talking about uh, um, passive. So I uh, kind of was checking it out a little bit and I didn't jump right in it right away. And uh, so anyhow, I went back and checked it out more and more and watched a couple of videos. And then I, I said, oh, man, this sounds like pretty darn good, you know. So I decided to get into it. And I've been in it for over, over a year now. And I'm very happy that I'm in it. And I um, nice saying about, you know, like uh, you don't have to buy the traffic. You don't have to get, you know, you have to get an Aweber and GoDaddy and, you don't have to do any of that kind of stuff because all that stuff is done done right here. I mean, they put the traffic in and and they'll get you all set up, make you look good. Um, so I did lose a lot of money in it. I'm very happy to be on Pass It, and uh, and it's going to come in strong when it launches. And let me tell you a little story. One time when I was a kid, 
when you used to have a paper out, you don't have a paper out anymore. I mean, that's a, that's an adult job now and ain't for kids anymore. But one time I used to have a paper out and I used to go deliver papers and, and it was an early morning paper out, really dark outside. So anyhow, I'm walking down the uh, sidewalk delivering papers. You know, I was kind of a monster, monster fan back in my kid days. You know, I was in Godzilla and all that stuff, you know. I don't know you guys know anything about Godzilla, but anyhow, I was walking down the sidewalk and delivering my papers. And I don't know why, I just happened to be thinking about monsters that morning, you know. And so here I am trying to deliver papers and it's, it's black outside. And I'm walking down, going past these houses. And all of a sudden I go past this house, plus, I mean, it was just dark. And the dogs start coming running out of me, started barking at me, and my heart went down to my toes. And I think, well, there's Godzilla, he's really, he's coming after me. So anyhow, just, you know, just like I say, this, this um, pass is gonna come in like a Godzilla and it's really gonna be a good thing for all of us. And, uh, and I'm really happy to be in it. And uh, so that's my story. <laughs> I'm not a big talker, but I try to do the best I can. Well, thank yeah, you, David. Great job, David. Hi. Can you people hear me? Yes, we can. Um, I love you very much. You're great. I am so happy to be part of this on passive thing. And I hate to put the elephant in the room, but, you know, yeah, you know, the, the money launch, uh, that kind of thing. Where's Mr. Ash? I hope he's nowhere around because he might get poke a stick at me or something. Are, is it going to launch or not? Marty, you want to take that? I'll take that one. There we go. Are we going to launch or not? If you ask the question, you haven't been paying attention. Bottom line, you haven't been looking at what we're doing, what's happening, and what's going on in Impassive. It's your fault. Are we going to launch? That's a really stupid question. Obviously, the answer to that is yes. And if you ask the other 175 people you know here, <laughs> that we're we're really really close. And I'll, I'll leave it at that, Mike. Yeah. If you ask the other 178 people that are here, yeah, they're gonna say yes. We've been in it. We stay in it. We love it. We live it. It's happening. We're going to be patient when it does. It's like I'm getting chills right now just talking about that because it's coming. And, yeah, and we're, I, we're, we're in it to work with it, right? Right we're on. In it we're in it to win right? it. So thank you for that question. You just woke up a lot of people's excitement. You got us even more excited about this launch. <laughs> it's kind of funny the guy's, the guy's magical too because he disappeared. Isn't that cool? Oh, Houdini. <laughs> I want to so hear how, how I got to impassive. I'm Karen. Hi, everybody. Hi, Karen. I, Hello. I, 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 when I got to impassive, well, you guys know a little, I don't know what you know. I got hurt over 12 years ago. I was in a wheelchair for quite a few years. I fought my way to get back out of the wheelchair, but I had to learn to walk and talk and all that good stuff. But that's not my point. I thought, okay, I could, I'll learn, relearn the computer. I'll buy a website. That's how I'll learn the computer. Wrote an idea, not a very good idea. Spent a ton of money, and I, uh, and I didn't have a clue what they were talking about. And somehow, I heard about someone called me about I'm passive, and I learned that it was um, automated. And I go, okay, so now I'm thinking. I won't have to try and learn all this stuff because it's too much for my brain to try and figure it out. It still is, but I'm trying. And in my amazement on passive is just the greatest thing on the planet. I, as long as I've been in here, I've learned so much about the computer. I mean, you guys might not think I've learned so much. I've learned everything from you guys. We're just turning on the computer and going, I didn't know what, YouTube was. I didn't know what to download was. I still don't, but I, I can turn it on and get into it and all that stuff. And and it's just like, I am, every time I hear you guys, I just get excited. I'm going to be able to help other people. And it's just, 
we, Karen, we totally understand. We, you know, we're here to lift you up. That's, that's yeah. just the greatest man on the planet. I think he's like a hero for people that have, have, have struggled. And, you know, I made a lot of money and it wasn't in, in online. I was on outside sales and in sales and uh, I made good money. I made great money. But when I got a little bit better, and I'm not all better, but when I got a little bit better, I didn't. I didn't stay connected to the computer. The only focus I had was getting out of the wheelchair. And that's what I spent day and night trying to get out of that wheelchair. When I, you know, it's been a couple of years since I got a tablet and, you know, it's, and I really, it was a tough time for me and I don't like to talk about it then because it makes me really worse. And I drank all, all the time I tried to, I didn't want to live then, and it's because of that I, you know, it's because of what he, he's giving me this opportunity. It's like, I don't, I, I don't know how to thank you guys. And it's like, it's like, I didn't, when I was trying to, to build my own website, I didn't know what they, they were just trying, they knew I was naive and not all there, and they just took advantage of me. And, She's the only one that didn't in Ron, my I mean the my 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 guy he's he's been such a gift to me guys he's been helps me and you know I don't wanna talk about you know the tough times I'm gonna think about the future and it's not that I don't cheer it because I try to and I and I get it all. I can't I can um like communicate it very well. I, I try to talk about technology, but I, I say words backwards still. And I, I mean, I'm trying to be blatantly honest with you right now. It's hard time. It's hard for me to try and you know say how much this company beats me because I'm on disability and I don't want to be on disability. I don't want to be a disability, but I know I can't get hired. I you know, and I, you know, I'm not perfect. I do things that are, you know, I shouldn't do, but I try not to. And it helps, you know, regardless. <laughs> but I, I've done accomplished more since I got, an, I'm, you know, in, in such a short period of time. I can't believe I'm on this. On the phone, I can do this. I couldn't barely even use the phone. I, I certainly, and I got the tablet, you know. And as told me, I messed up the whole system. Yeah, I probably did. I didn't do it on purpose. I don't know how to. So. Karen, you're in a good place, so don't worry. I'll pass it and work out this great for you. Don't worry about it. You're in a perfect place. Yeah, you're in a good place. Yes, Karen. Uh, hi, Marty. Hi, Mike. It's Julie. Uh, may I say a few words? Yes, of course. Uh, what you're seeing on my screen right now, it's actually the sunset here in California. Uh, Karen, please. Uh, uh, just, just staring at the sunset and just know that you and many people are in the same boat or even worse but you are here with us and non-passive and I don't know if anyone or even that gentleman that just raised the question if you go back and watch Ash's heart his heart is busting out because he loves us so much he loves us so much but he has a big a big responsibility in his shoulder. What we all need to do, it's with, and, and I'm speaking this, it's however you take it, but what we all need to do is extend your hand out and bless him, pray for him, because he has many of us on his shoulder right now. And it's very hard to be in that space. I just don't know what to say, but I wanted to send you this positive energy from the sunset. Send out the positive energy, send out the blessings. The more blessings you send out, 
the more blessings it comes back to you and send them towards Ash because he's here. He's here. And all the leadership council, I'm not going to name them because I know I will miss them, but all the leadership council, all the active members, uh, founders out there, all of them. And one blessings to my dear friend, Milo. I'm here because of him. I'm here because he blessed me with this opportunity. And Karen, it's okay, honey. It's fine. Don't worry about it. We are here. Milo and I have put the Milo, uh, my Julie and Milo show together. It's for you. We removed all the personal link attached to that play playlist. You take it, just take it and share it. And just if you can't explain it, and if Milo and I couldn't explain it, our guests could explain it. Our the passion, the passion, and the stories of all the founder in on passive can share it, and you they can see it through. Because the only way that you can understand on passive fully is you take the action, and then you plug in, and the, and then you attend webinar, and you have to put the dots together in order for you to fully understand it. But the only thing that you want to understand is understand and see through Ash's heart because his heart is busting, like burst out with love and passion for what he does. So take his heart and share it like it is your heart. And, um, we have extended Hen out to invite a lot of our leadership because Milo and I wanted to put that show out. It's for all of us, for all of us to educate ourselves, to for all of us to take it and share it. Please take it, share it, copy it, do whatever it takes and share your heart out. And the only way for people to join you, it's when you connecting your mind that you learn from on passive and your heart that you connecting with the same frequency with Ash. And then the word that you speak will be very powerful for you to be able to share that on passive message. And on passive is here with us and it gets so close. Um, and thank you for allowing me to say these words I feel you, Karen, and I feel so many of us sharing the same message. It's, it's here. It's getting so close. Just, it's getting so close. Thank you so much for letting me share this. I have a couple of questions you about the... I just want to say something really quick. It's like, wait a minute. Oh, my Julie. In just a second. Oh, my Julie. Thank you for lifting all of us up. Thank you. So I'm sorry. Go ahead, Anthony. Hi, good night to the Unpassive family. Mm -hmm. um, good night to Ash. I know, I don't, I, I don't think that people really understand the responsibility the CEO have because it's something good he wants to do. It's something great. It's something to benefit the world entirely. Even some people might be founders. He's still trying to do something to benefit everybody, even some the in or the not in. You understand? I don't think people really understand the great responsibility and the dynamics and what he's trying to do. But this whole thing to me, it, come, it comes just like fate. You understand? Fate is something you're hoping for. But we, nobody knows what the next day will bring. You understand? The next day could bring plenty joy as well as sorrow. But we on the positive mind because everybody have God in the heart and have love in the heart. Right? And the CEO, he's doing his best. If people could have a little patience and be humble, because I show everyone here this already. Good things come to those who wait. If you rush something, it, it might come quick and easy. And then as quick as it comes, it's as quick as it goes. I don't know, this is, this is the best way I could probably bring it out to explain to people. I hope they understand. I know everybody probably might be going through the little problems and whatnot. But just the same way how before Unpassive came and there was going through the problems as well, but at least we have hope for a brighter day ahead. So we could see the light at the end of the tunnel. And that is the best 
I can say it about this. Good night, everyone. Blessings. Hey, Marty, Marty I have a question. Yeah, uh, go ahead. So it's about the last webinar. Um, Ash mentioned something about maybe doing the beta testing with like half a dozen products or so. Do you know if those will go out to all the founders or just the big boys are the ones that get to play with those products? Mike Ellis, maybe you might uh, have a better answer for him on that. Um, <clears throat> when, when Ash talked about the products that are going to be available when we launch, um, I don't, don't worry too much about that. Um, uh, that, that number is going to change. And as the products come out, we get into the soft launch, we're all going to be able to, to get in and play with the products and see if we can break them. That's, that's part of the test he wants to do. We won't be able to. But the number of products, don't get, uh, don't get stuck on that. Ash, uh, you really have to understand Ash and what he's saying at the moment. And a lot of times he'll say something and, and yeah, there's some, there's some truth in, in it, but the numbers might differ as we get into the soft launch. I, I think as we get into the soft launch, um, we're, there are going to be plenty of products in there for us to go in and play with. Uh, and you're going to be impressed with them. Um, yeah, I wasn't worried about the number, Mike. More just like, will that opportunity be for everybody? It it'll sounds be for like you. it will be. Perfect. It will be. It, it will be for you. Great. Thank you. Okay. Yeah. Hey, Mike, can I say something? Sure. Hey, uh, this is Jim from Stratford, Ontario, Canada. I just wanted to touch on a couple things here. Um, Mike, Ellis, God bless you. I really appreciate everything that you say about the volume. To every founder here and whoever is listening who might see the recording, Think of it this way. When Mike talks about the numbers, the numbers are simple. If every founder, and we're up to the hundred, what, 430,000 now? If every person brings in one customer, double it. That's almost a million people right there because we are all customers. And every founder is going to surely have more than one or two customers in the long run. So the volume is very, very high. I see it drastically. Second thing, I look at Ash as a builder, a major builder. We have a TV show up here in Canada. It's like a home improvement show. The guy goes around renovating houses, fixing work from other renovators. His name's Mike Holmes. And he has an analogy. And it's... <laughs> It's, it's Ash to a T. When you think about the launch, he's, he's getting it right the first time. He's just not going to put Band-Aids in here. He's going to get it right the first time. That's what I wanted to say. And I'll end it with this to try and cheer up some of the excitement. Go Founders Go, the passively, built by design. <laughs> there you go, guys. Thank you, Jim. So Marty, let's, let's bring another one of the gals out. And I mean, if you guys are gonna come out, I'm, I'm a big cry baby, don't make me cry. <laughs> I love the stories. I'm gonna have to go get a towel. <laughs> oh, Diane in British Columbia. You're sitting back, you come out and tell us, um, I love these chats and, and yeah. Why on passive for you? What's, well, I kind of uh, wanted to put my sister on the spot. She's watching this video. She's been a founder for a while, but she's not plugged in. She's, she's asking, who's this Mike Horde? Who's this Mike Ellis? <laughs> so I'm, I'm kind of texting her back and forth. Uh, I'm trying to get the point across. There's time for her to get plugged in here. And that's just super important with on passive. A lot of people, they just, because they don't know anything about it, they can't get that feeling of, hey, this is going to be crazy big. So that's my, that's just what I wanted to say. Just everybody should really get plugged in. Try to get your people to get plugged in. This thing is going to just explode.
Thanks, you guys. I can tell you, uh, Diane, Mike Ellis is a builder in Colorado, and I'm a builder in California, and we want to stop building buildings because we're, we've done that. We've been very successful at it. We've done very well at it. And now we're ready to move on to another chapter. And now that, you know, that chapter is on passive because if you're just plugging in and you're wondering what on passive is all about, especially if you're here as a founding member, on passive is gonna take care of, Mike talks about it all the time, your bottom line. It's gonna take care of you financially. It's gonna give you enough extra money to do the things like Ash talks about. Like he rings down this, this giving, like culture that is on passive. We're all looking forward to the day when we're gonna help change the world and give the, the people in the areas that don't have good drinking water, good drinking water. We're gonna drill wells. We're not just gonna carry waters and we're gonna help drill wells. We're gonna, my passion is the homeless. Um, so much that we can do when we, when we have enough to fill up our bank accounts and there's and it's overflowing. I tell myself every day when I get up and I'm, I'm working out with my dumbbells, I have all that I need. I have more than enough money flows to me and through me with these. I say that all the time. There's a lot of things that I do in my mind that have created on passive for me. See, a year ago, my birthday's coming up in two days. A year ago, I had to move out of my motel room because I couldn't afford to stay in it. On my birthday, January 11th. And... I kept telling myself, everything's going to be okay. First, I was thinking, man, I'm going to freeze to death. <laughs> January in Sacramento is 30 degrees. And so I'm sitting in my truck and I'm saying, man, I, I need to change my, my, what I'm programming in here. Everything's going to be okay. I have all the money I need to pay all of my bills. I have all the money I need to pay back everybody I borrowed any money from. And I have plenty of extra money. This has been the greatest year of my life. I have had so much work. I have on passive. Now, this few days before my birthday, I'm very well invested. I have money in the bank. Why? Because I told myself instead of, I am screwed, <laughs> I'm gonna freeze to death. I have no money. No, everything is okay. Everything's gonna be all right. And I just kept repeating that over and over and over. A year later, I'm moving into a launch with On Passive that's going to set me and all of you free. We have so much blessings coming to us because of On Passive. And I got to think that that year ago, one of the reasons we're all here is because I manifested this. <laughs> Viviana knows it. Um, I started a ripple, and here we are. And I'm gonna let it. I'm gonna let it continue. I'm gonna throw some more pebbles in the pond. Hey, Mike. I know yes, Tim. I know that you're uh, you're within the age group that you probably remember the '80s music, and I'm I'm big on the on music, but there was a song that Huey Lewis and the News did. I want a new drug. Yeah. Mm -hmm. What's on passive? It's our new it's drug. It's my new drug. It's our new drug. Yes. Damn right. Right. But so I, yeah, again, sorry, I yeah. again, we are involved in a very historical thing that is happening. It's Let's happening. embrace it. Let's take it and go with it. And I want to especially thank Julie for reaching out to Karen because I think that was very important and shows exactly who on passive is. Yeah, thank you, Sam, and thank you, Diane. Thank you and all. thank you for yeah. Thank you for like making me remember something. So I always love to we're getting close to uh like over an hour here, like like close to the hour, a little over an hour. I always love to Bring Sean Cyrus out. Man, this guy is so well-spoken and so full of love for so many people and very close to Ash Farah. Um, consider him a brother. And Sean, come on. We love you. Come on out, Sean. <laughs>
It's always a pleasure, guys. It's always a pleasure to uh, be here with you guys, my family. Um, you know, just hearing what you have to say. It just John, you're a little low on the mic. We, we can't hear you very well. I mean, we want to hear you, brother. <laughs> Can you hear me now? Yes, a little better. Yeah, I know. Just saying that it um it always brings me back to to understand why we're all here, you know, and everybody here just wants a better future. And um everybody here just wants to be successful. And you know, we all we've all we've all gone through things and we all are currently going through things, you know. But what I can say overall is the restoration of faith, you know, that this company and this these people, all of us has brought to the table and just everybody's has restored faith and you know, you can dream again and um, you know, spend some time just loving life and living your life rather than stressing and worrying about everything, you know. We all have bills, bills are residual and we're searching for residual income. So I mean, it's just a blessing, you know, as you see what's going on in the world today, you know, a lot of people aren't here, uh, you know, especially from what happened with uh, the last year we had 2019, 2020, it's been a roller coaster. And, you know, I feel that we are, are, are just um, kind of in the safe, safe zone with, with what we have here, where at least we can say, you know, we can build a legacy and build some wealth. So I just believe that um, it's a great opportunity for, anyone who doesn't have family or people that they feel that they can get close to, you know, we are all brothers and sisters here and we can just become one and, and know that we all have faith and belief. And, 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 and most importantly, we can believe in ourselves again. You know, a lot of people have lost hope and lost faith in themselves. And, you know, everybody's who said that you weren't going to be nothing, you know, we've all want to prove them wrong. And, so on and so forth. So it's just a good good opportunity for people to have faith again and believe and dream. And it's going to be an amazing, an amazing uh, 2021. You know, um, I had mentioned on the Thursday webinar that, you know, an ounce of um, prevention is better than a pound of cure. And, you know, just understand that's what Ash is doing. He's um, making sure to prevent things from, um, not going the way we want and just uh making sure that all the dominoes fall the way they're supposed to and that's what's going to be most important you know as a brother i don't remember his name a brother who spoke before mentioned that you know all good things you know they take a while you know they anything that comes to you that comes and it's um comes fast it will just leave you quickly as well so we want to we want a quality company we want to build quality and and that's the main thing here. So for anybody who feels that they just um, need a uplifting, like Karen, you know, just anybody who feels like that, just understand what you have here, it, it, it's, it's going to change your life and um, it's going to uh, definitely be worth it. So I won't talk too long. I know everybody's probably got things to do Saturday night, but just wanted to show up and say, um, blessings to everybody. But I do have one question. Uh, we did uh, see Ash had an acronym or a um, few letters that he shared in the community. I don't know if people are here who isn't, but I don't know if Mike Ellis or Marty knows what does uh, MPL stand for. I'm curious to find out that because I'm not sure. So I'll leave on that and we can discuss that before we go. Yes, Thanks, I, yes I know, Sean, and I'm not telling you. No, no, I have no idea. No, I, I have no idea. I don't even go there because, you know, it's just going to drive me nuts. But, yeah, we'll figure it. He'll tell us sooner or later. You know, Mike, you were, Mike Horde, you were talking about believing in something and, 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 and happening. People need to realize that whatever you believe is going to happen. If you believe you can't, you won't. If you believe you can, you will. I mean, it's, it really happens. I worked with Mike Ellis and Dan Street for years, like, and we built we, 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 that today. we yep. built teams, and but it was never felt right. And I remember us talking. Someday, we'll be in the right team with the right people, 
and it will be unbelievable. And that's where we are today. It took a while. It didn't happen easy. But two years ago, March, there was three guys that owned Passive Nation. Now there's thousands. And, it, and guess what? It's, let me tell you what it really is. And I said this, and it's 100% true. You draw who you are. So the reason you guys relate to Ask Me Far is because you're like him in your own way. It's exactly why. I've seen people that don't have that kind of heart and they're me, 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 me. They quit. They're the ones that want their 97 back. the guy that just left the call. Yeah, that's right. They, they want their 97 back. Well, he didn't leave voluntarily. But anyway, he was escorted out of the building. <laughs> Elvis has left the building. Uh, that's the power of the button. I got a powerful button here. No, but seriously, yeah. that's what happens. I mean, I, I've had one guy out of uh, me, Mike, and Dad, thousands that wanted his money back. And I'll tell you what. I begged him to take his money back because he was a butt wife. And, and, and I flat right out just said, man, I can't wait for you to go. And they got rid of him like as quick as you could because we are surrounded by people who were liked. I believe that. It's, it's obvious. We're different colors and look different. I mean, not everybody is that you're looking as me, but that's just part of life, right? So, <laughs> we can... Anyway, uh, if anybody's got anything else, go for it. But this is hey, an, hey, Marty, I'm going to say something accident. else. Go ahead. Yeah. Um, you know, Ash talked about a lot of books, um, and a lot of other people chimed in yeah. about the books. I have read most of them, and I've read some of the others. And there's one book that um, I, I love because many of the motivational speakers, uh, their presence comes from James Allen, As a Man Thinketh written in 18 something, 1800s. And it's about this big. It's not a real big book. It's a quick read. And I think one of the reasons that I do so well at Mindset, it's like I, I woke up at five o'clock this morning because I told myself last night that I was gonna get up at five o'clock this morning. And I, did, I don't have an alarm clock. I haven't had one since I was 26. That was Zig Ziglar. Zig Ziglar says you don't need an alarm clock. They scare you. It says alarm, right? It alarms you. And I've never had an alarm clock I'm 62, I haven't had an alarm clock since I was 26, and I can always wake up whenever I put it in here. Whatever you program in here, you get. Think about how simple that is. I program getting up at five. I program being financially stable and not having to worry about money. I, I don't say, uh, I want to get out of debt. Wrong. It's what you say. It's how you say it and how you put it in here. And Marty, you know that because you've done it too. You, you progress through life by manifesting things that you put in here and you said it will be, this is already done. Little As a matter of fact, no advice. Yes. Don't so, get a hold. Hey, we're, yeah, we're ready to close out. I just want to bring Mike Ellis out and have him close the meeting out for us. And I appreciate y'all being here. I just, I'm totally blown away because we represent so many people around the globe and I, that excites me to no end on passive excites me really happy you're all here and, Thank you all for coming. Happy New Year. And uh, Mike, close us out here. Um, <clears throat> as you all can tell, I'm pretty passionate about on passive. Uh, the negative stuff, I, I have no patience for whatsoever. Um, <laughs> and and it's, it's just who I am. Mar Marty and Dan cringe when I get in that mode. Uh, but, but, but it is done in love, even though you might not see it. Unpassive is here for all of us. Uh, you, you, you really don't have to worry about anything. Uh, Marty talks with Ash every week. I get, the, I get the scoop on everything that they're talking about. Occasionally, I get to talk with them. Um, we're in a really, really good place. And uh, I, I look forward to getting together with all of you um, this year, someplace, I don't know where. And we can, uh, we can do a toast. It'll, it'll be a fun time. Go ahead, Mike. Thank you, Mike. Thank you, Marty. And thank you all for being here. Um, enjoy the rest of your weekend. Um, it's, it's like, I wish I could go all these different places, like uh, the places that I've seen in the chat. If you went on there, you seemed like, it's like we got Africa and we got Canada and we got I mean, every place you can think about. I'm going to go visit them all, you know, someday. So, and again, I love you. Yeah, everybody unmute. Say, say goodnight. Talk all night or what? Right.
No, we're not doing Ash. <laughs> Good night, Mike. everybody. Thanks, Mike. Good night, everybody. Happy birthday, Mike. Happy birthday to you, Mike. Good night, everyone. Good to see you, Angie. Good night, Joy. Happy birthday, Mike. Good night, everyone. Good night, everyone. Good night, everyone. Good night. Happy birthday, Mike. Mike, you and I have the same birthday. Oh, beautiful. You're a captain. Yeah. Yeah, you do. Happy birthday, Julie. Thank you, Sherry. Uh, I, I'll, I'll connect with you on Facebook. That was good. Sherry. Thank See you, you everyone. Good night. Good night. Hey, Kevin, what were you going to say? I was I just saying good night. Oh, good night. Okay. Is that good night? Good night. <laughs> <laughs> At least I said something, right? <laughs> How about the other Kevin? Did you say something, Kevin? Oh. <laughs> no, I was just saying oh. thank you. Thank uh, you, Mike Ellis. I appreciate you. Good night. Good night. Um, Good night, Cedric. Good night, Larry. Good to see you guys here. Thank you all. Good night. Um, appreciate everything you're doing. Good night, Jim. Good night, everybody. Good night, John Boy. Good night, Jim. Bob. <laughs> we don't have John Boy. <laughs> Mary Ellen. I'm never going to get tired of hearing that. Good night, Marty Bob. <laughs> Marty Bob. <laughs> Kaboom! That's what Marty wants to hear. Yeah. We oh, thought it was football. See, I forgot about the playoffs. I'm watching the hockey game right now. It's it's touchdown. All right, good night everybody. All right, y'all. Good night. Good night. Good night. It's good night. touchdown game.